All right, welcome back to the Oki Smoking Channel. We're doing a little bit of a late night cookout here on the pit barrel today with just some thick pork chops I found at the local Winco we have. And these are some really, really nice and thick pork chops that we just put some uh, SPG, covered them in it with some olive oil, I went ahead and placed a hook on them. And these are some of the thicker pork chops I've found. I've done several cooks on the pit barrel like this, and they're usually a lot thinner, but thicker the better, I think, when it comes to smoking these. That's going to give it some time to smoke. And uh, really didn't do much. No marination, no nothing. We're just going to hang about five of these on here, throw in a little asparagus uh, later, and hang it on there as the cook about finalizes. So I went ahead and put a meter uh, plus, which is... Uh, these right here, uh, maybe I'll have a video on them a little later, but basically they're a little wireless uh, that this connects to the probe that is in the uh, pork chops here. And right here is one. And it just goes ahead and will send to my computer. I have a MacBook and it will send it to it or an Android phone or whatever else. So I can monitor the temperature uh, to get these up to proper uh, temperature and then I put it in the biggest ones uh, so hopefully uh, when those are done they're all done no questions asked so I've had this fire going now for just a little bit let's take a look and I just went ahead and started these as I always do just I went ahead and burnt uh, some of the charcoal got it started with a fire starter a uh, little uh, chimney and then poured them on top of a bunch of charcoal it's ready so we're going to go ahead and place these or go ahead and hang these up in here this one here has one of those sensors in it i have two this one also has a sensor in it that's it let them hang like that this shouldn't take too long let me put the lid on and that's it so I'm just going to wait until these get up to proper temperature of about 160 to 165 degrees and they'll be done so I've got some asparagus in this basket right here we've got some olive oil on it some salt some pepper looking really really nice so what I'm going to do is go ahead and add this asparagus in there to cook for about 20 minutes. Put this little hanging basket in there. So it's been about 45 minutes. Um, those are some thicker pork chops. They also we're pretty cold in the center, about 29 degrees is what they recorded once we put them on the pit barrel. Uh, so if you have some that are thawed out a little more, it may get done just a hair quicker. Again, 145 is the temperature we're looking for. I'm just going to let this asparagus cook until everything's done, and I think it's going to be really, really good. So stay tuned for the plating, and uh, we'll see how it is. And my name is John, and this is the Oki Smoking Channel right here in the state of Oklahoma. I hope you enjoy this video, and if you do, be sure and give it a like and subscribe for more. It's all about outdoors. So all the pork chops I've tested them are right around 145 degrees. They're done. I took the asparagus out and tested it, and it could use a little more cooking, so I placed it back in. Uh, the pork chops took a little longer than anticipated so it's been about a half hour and i would say when you're cooking asparagus on this go ahead and plan 30 45 minutes it is a smoker after all and i think everything's going to come out great so let's go ahead and take a look now and look at how well man these things look really really good may be hard to see it's kind of dark out but you can see there's the asparagus hanging right there so we're going to go ahead and pull uh, these off
And that's the finished asparagus. An amazing flavor, good smoke flavor. That thick pork chop got some juice in the middle. Really, really good. That pork, that was really, really good. If you enjoyed this video, be sure and subscribe for more content like this. Amazing, thank you for watching.